There is a game called Baratrauma, where multiple players have to compete with each other for a title of the dumbest person alive. The game describes itself as a 2D co-op submarine simulator featuring survival horror elements, and the survival horror part is the real players you have to cooperate with, because despite all the challenges the game will toss your way, the biggest threat of them all will always be the incompetence of your own crew. Power up the reactor and we're gonna start moving. There's a fire! Fire! The game will make you question the intelligence of the human race as a whole, including yourself. According to Steam achievements, less than 3% of all players have completed the campaign because pretty much any small problem that occurs on your submarine will snowball into an avalanche of huge issues in a matter of seconds unless it's taken care of. Ironically enough, most of the butterfly effect incidents are actually caused by your own crew. The key difference between each role is just stats and unique skills, but generally there's also social hierarchy involved and you're expected to stick to your primary job. Mechanics and engineers roles are to repair everything on the ship. You're essentially the backbone of the submarine, but you will be paid minimal wage until until you threaten them to mess up the reactor, which usually leads to stuff like this. Medic's role is to keep everyone alive on the submarine by either injecting them with packs of and or providing CPR by using the most unethical methods possible. You can also roleplay as Walter White and cook funny blue rocks, and if you pick this role, you automatically get added to a watch list alongside of other players who play RimWorld and Kenshi. Security's job is to keep everyone in place, but most of the time you will just end up detaining wrong person and cause more chaos than there was before you got involved. Captain's sole role is to command the crew and pilot the ship, but most of the gameplay will be just you giving unclear directions to your gunners and yelling at mechanics. Multiple crawlers approaching us, 3 o'clock. 3 o'clock, that's above. There's also an assist role, but it's kind of a I don't know what I'm doing type of role, and if you join a server and your crew player list looks like this, you're completely doomed and there's absolutely nothing you can do. But it's like watching a car crash, you just can't look away. The assistant role also has a dedicated skill tree just for clowning, but from my experience you won't see much of a difference between somebody who is dressed up as a clown and somebody named Microwave. At the end of the day, the game is named after Barotrauma Syndrome, often associated with hearing loss, but it's not due to the water pressure changes, but due to the fact that the game allows you to set your microphone volume to 500%, which leads to permanent hearing loss of everyone in the lobby of the moment you open your mouth. Wait, can you say something in the game? Ah! Oh my god, my ears! So me and my friend decided to try hosting a two-player server just to get a hang of controls before joining a public server, and it went pretty well. Oh, there we go. <laughs> you didn't change your name, you just twisted. <laughs> god damn it! Oh my god, we're, we're five <laughs> seconds into this game, you already smacked it! You give me a blood force trauma! I can control submarine now. I don't know how, because I didn't do the tutorial for a captain. I did every tutorial besides the captain. Uh, why are we sinking? Uh, we gotta hit something. Oh, this is bad. Oh, this uh, is bad, bad. There's a scary looking creature on the ship. Get off, brother! I'm dead. Yeah, I'm dead as well. I think we're ready for multiplayer. Yeah. The game has a big modding community, and a huge portion of all servers require you to install 50 different anime waifu mods for whatever reason, and for my first experience, I wanted to try something vanilla first, so our options were limited. Okay, so I found two vanilla servers. One of them is called 100% Hardcore Roleplay No Italians, and the other one is called Hit Game Among Us. Which one do you choose? Needless to say, we joined the Hit Game Among Us, and it didn't take long until we met our captain. What am I, a mechanic? I swear to God, if you're gonna punch me- I'm gonna hit the clown. You're very welcome to do so. Hello, captain. Oh my god. Is that really you? It is me, the soup. Abortion pizza restaurant. Oh, oh my, my god. God. <laughs> god fucking damn it. What's our salary? Oxygen. Oxygen is not a salary. James is trying to turn this ship into r slash anti work. I just hear him every now and then like, what's our salary? Oxygen is not a salary. Speaking of salary, today's video is sponsored by Dungeon Fighter Online, a free to play 2D online multiplayer hack and slash RPG with over 850 million players worldwide. The game features more than 60 unique class advancements, all of unique story and techniques to fit your personal style. Right now is a great time to try out the game since the newest updates introduced a lot of level up events with tons of activities and rewards. You can either create a new character or use an existing one and you will still get all the benefits, like an ability to receive generous rewards and materials at target levels you acquire, as well as the rewards for just playing the game, and the more you play, the better are the rewards. In fact, for a limited time, you can get some of the rewards for simply logging in or even just typing happy birthday DFO in the chat because it's the game's 8th anniversary. So don't miss out on these limited time events and click the link down below to discover more. And make sure to use a bonus coupon code welcome to DFO gift to get a bunch of really cool stuff for free. And don't forget to subscribe. Captain, do I have permission to kill the clown? I, I don't like clowns. <laughs> I actually need to take the headset off so the clown can't hear. <laughs> kill the damn clown. I've been given orders to kill you! The captain did indeed order to kill you. Captain gave me orders to kill the clown. We need a medic. Half of our crew is dead and we haven't even embarked yet. How's the situation, captain? Very gay. <laughs> Elaborate, please. Bend over. Uh, Captain's orders and uh, 
Start a plantation. Oh my god. I think I injured my leg. Maybe this will heal you a little bit. Hang on. Uh huh. I was trying to show you my ass, James. You, you're on the radio. <laughs> Don't say it on the radio. Now everybody knows. <laughs> now everybody knows. <laughs> Fuck. Oh, gosh darn it. I'll just host it myself. So I decided to host my own server and since no one wanted to be a captain I had to volunteer myself. You're gonna get 20% from our missions twisted uh, salary You're gonna take 4% uh, from our missions. Wait, what? Hold up. I went to medical school. Uh, hey, I went to security hey. school how, <laughs> okay. do, how do I know you're not gonna do a mutiny right now, huh? <laughs> <laughs> You're not gonna do a whatever the fuck word you just said. A mubidi. Mubidi. <laughs> <laughs> I went to med school, not language school. <laughs> We're gonna have to keep an eye on this doctor over here. <laughs> Did you just close the door on yourself and just smack yourself in the head while trying to be serious? No. So our submarine only had three people. One medic, one captain, and one security officer. So nobody knew how to do any mechanical stuff. Can somebody please turn on the generator? I don't know where that is. Wait, this is a nuclear reactor. Hold on, never mind. Throw stuff in the reactor and turn it on. Please uh, morally support our mechanic downstairs, because I think they're having issues with the- I'm not the... even a mechanic, I'm a security guard! Crank all those dials all the way up. So what if I do just crank it up? Mm -hmm. Maximum hour. Don't crank it, you're not soldier boy. <laughs> <laughs> that Superman, that ho! Would you guys like to go mining or would you rather kill a big uh, endangered species? Big endangered species. I trust in you guys. Well, that's your first mistake. Okay. Oh. <laughs> all right, we have crawlers about 300 meters to our uh, right. Do you all have a diving mask on you? Please tell me that you do. I do not. I, I definitely do not. We have a bit of an issue. I think there's a leak. Well, yeah, they're the front of the oh, there's a leak. Put your diving mask on. The clown, fix the ship. Where's I don't have my diving mask. I don't know. I told you to get the diving mask! I told you to get the diving mask! I dropped it! You panicked me and I dropped it! It's got me! It's got me! And that's why we need the mechanic. <laughs> Dude, yeah, I was so panicked when the water when you guys opened the door and the water came rushing in. I tried to put my mask on and I just dropped it and could not find it. <laughs> Our biggest weakness was the lack of crewmates, so I decided to solve this problem by pinging at everyone on my Discord server. Every now and then, I host private lobbies for various games, so if you want to join, feel free to join our Discord server. You may need to become a supporter first though, which costs only $1. I'll leave a link down below. So after getting a dozen of new people on our submarine, we received an incredible mission. We had to transport clowns to a safe location. Can I fight the clown? I can't get over this fucking squeak. This clown, literally every time he takes a step, it's like squeaking. Hello there. Oh god. There is a clown in a wheelchair. God right, damn it, really? Are we just transporting clowns? Yeah, yeah did, did, transporting did you not? Know what you're signing up for? Oh, that's that's sick. I'm okay with that. I'm not. I'm afraid of clouds. I'm forced to be here. I'm here for my 200 hours of community service. It didn't take even two minutes until somebody opened an airlock and got a bunch of water in our submarine. There seems to be a problem. It's already going down. Oh, yeah, indeed. Good right observation. Right. There's something that's outside that wants inside. I got this. I got this. I've got to be the hero. Oh, God. It's no good. Oh, let me in! Let me back in! I'm trying! Pull me in! Grab my leg! Are you doing all right? What do you mean, am I doing all right? I got out of the ship trying to fix it and you locked me outside! Do you see the cracks? Start fixing them! Next time we should have probably got a bigger submarine. I can't hear a word because I'm wearing a suit and I'm afraid to take it off because I'm surrounded by idiots. That's the water closet. This is an air- No! I think we may have lost the one of our uh, crew members. Captain, can I go into the water closet? Am I the only one who hears uh, alarm to our left? That's the dance alarm. Oh, we, we, we made it alive. Oh, like 30 died. people died. After successfully transporting a group of clowns, and I'm not referring to our crew, we spent the entirety of our paycheck on the vending machines. Questions, Captain. Why do our vending machines have opium? We have opium chips and monster energy drinks. Where's the monster energy at? Uh, there's things in the water. Something's trying to make a hole here constantly. Any major injury? Don't worry about me, man. I feel great. You're having an opiate overdose, so I'm just gonna give you this. Did he really take all the opioids from the fucking vending machine? <laughs> we need new vaulting stuff. Uh, is this? Uh, yeah, yes. we don't talk yeah. about that. And only Twisted was crushed by the water pressure. Of course, that happened. I decided to go out the funny little door into the ocean. I quickly got eaten. There's so many people in this crew, and I still couldn't find a single person who asked. I have a screwdriver, and I have a wrench. Say that to my face. Say that to my face. It was me. It was me. It was me. That's right. That's right. Don't worry. You want some more? Oh, yeah. What's some more? Hey, 
He was a <laughs> Why am I getting tired? Stop it! That's it! I'm sick of it! Calm down. Mute me! Okay. Come on, Twisted. Let's let's go have some opium and monster. Twisted is dead. I'm not even the one who killed him. More opium and monster for me. 